Hello everyone, welcome back to Traffic Table channel. Today I'm going to show you how to design an interior for a coloring book uh, related to Easter niche. Especially we will make uh, an Easter egg mandala. Uh, and I will show you how to uh, boot the interior and boot the right dimension. I will show you some tips on how to use PowerPoint. If it's first time for you, it's going to be very useful for you. Uh, and if, if you can also use PowerPoint, maybe you can find something useful. So let's get started. First of all, I want to make a book which is 8.5 times 11 inches, uh, no bleed. Okay, so that means that first of all, I have to adjust my dimensions. So uh, what I'm going to do, this is a PowerPoint interface from the first time and you go for design here on the left section up and then you go here on the slide and size and then you choose custom slide size okay and here slide size 4 i choose always custom and always make sure it's inches and then we are gonna put 8.5 times 11 Okay, great. And leave the slides for one for now. It's okay. And then make the post art portrait. Okay. And then maximize. There we go. And then we have the 8.5 times 11 section. And we're gonna design our or put our interior here. So first of all, what we need to do is to remove these two rectangle right here and also remove that. So it's going to be a blank white page. And what we want to do now is to bring our interior. So how can we bring the interior? It's very easy. If you want like an Easter Mandela, you can just go uh, for like Pix Bay maybe, or you can go for Creative Fabrica. I like to go to for Creative Fabrica. So yeah, I will show you where did, yeah. If you go to Creative Fabrica and I wrote Easter Egg KDB, you can find a lot of stuff uh, like 20 Easter Eggs coloring pages, Easter Egg coloring book for adults. As you can see, there are a lot of stuff, 30 Easter Egg Mandela's coloring book, Mandela Easter coloring pages. So what I'm usually doing, I download one from here, one from here, and yeah, yeah. and then try to mix something together. So I will be unique. I, will, I don't want to duplicate or I don't want my interior to be like all the people. What I'm gonna do is just download all of these egg Easter Mandela and then mix them together and make my own. You know what I mean? So what I did already is I downloaded that, this, this and a lot of other pages you can see here. And then you can download some eggs from here and also you can download from Bixby or another website. The most important part that uh, you have to to be sure that these uh, designs are uh, allowable for commercial and POD use. Okay, and you can find the link in the description for Creative Fabrica. Yeah, it's affiliate link, so if you use it, I will have a small commission. So, first of all, I download it and then I go to the PowerPoint. And what we're gonna do here is we are going to press insert. And the trick here, I want to download or sorry, upload all the pages on a PowerPoint uh, in one time. So if we, if we want to upload all the pages uh, in one step, so what we're gonna do is we press insert and then photo album here and then new photo album. And then we press file and slash disk. Great. And here we go. Here is the, the one that I chose already. And I'm going to show you what is this later, but the most important part are the eggs. And then what we're going to do is just press insert. Uh, sorry, first of all, we have to uh, yeah, check all. So we have to make control A or easy. We have to do like that. But I don't want this, so I will make shift control. And yeah, so only the eggs. Great, and here we go. And the, the most important part that here that's very cool because you can choose, for example, this egg and you can move it to the down or to up. Okay, but what we want to do now is to uh, go and make the album. So we will just press create. 
So we have to wait a bit because sometimes it takes like uh, yeah some seconds. And once we press create, we will notice that all of the eggs is like an album, and that's great. So as we can see, it's here. It looks like an album because it have like this black background. But we're gonna uh, yeah we're gonna delete all of that right now. So we go to the first page and just delete it because we don't want that. And here we have to go again on the first page to design and make again what we did before slide at the beginning 8.5 times 11 inches cool and then okay and maximize and here we go here we have our egg mandela easter pages 8.5 times 11 and everything is ready to go and that's it's easy like that yeah, it's so easy. Exactly. And what we're gonna do now is um, is I'm gonna show you. Maybe you can make it like one page egg, one page blank. You can just make like this. Click, click, uh, right click, and then make a new slide. And here you go. It's it's blank. Here, right click and new slide. Right click and new slide. So it's better if you make it like one page uh, to color and one page leave for the bleed or because you know that sometimes the color is mixing. So it's better always to do like that. It's very easy. It will not take so much time. Yeah, you got the idea. Okay. And yeah, you go for all the book. And here we go. We have the interior. And what I'm going to show you now also is uh, how to design the first page because it's very important uh, to how to design the first page. So I will make new slides. I will bring it here. And first of all, if you want to design the first page also, and you have to know that all of these eggs are no bleed. So it's okay. Like nothing is going to the edges. So it's no bleed. And I will show you how to be sure that everything is right with no bleed. So first of all, we need to click on the right on the mouse and then go to grid and guides and then go to our guides. So we have these two guidelines. So we have to, we want to copy another one, another vertical one. So we need a vertical guide and here add a horizontal guide. We need two. So here we go. And we want to leave 0.5 inches from both. So if you can see here, there is a, like a ruler. Okay. And I want to leave here is 4.25 and here is zero. So if it's here, because it's all 8.5 inches, right? So from here is zero and starting increasing to 4.5. So what I want to do is leaving 0.5 inches from all the borders. So it's 4.5. I want to be 3.75. To be 0.5 here we go and here also 4.5 no i want 3.75 so i left 0.5 from here 0.5 inches from here and the same time here so it's 5.5 and 5.5 because it's 11 and i will make it 5 here so it's 0.5 and here also 5 that's cool so this is the safe area that's called the safe area where you can boot your design so if you go to the the x section we can find it's already the lines the guiding lines is in between the the x is in between the guidelines which means everything is perfect so take care if the egg is on that line it's going to be trimmed so it's not safe so make sure always that the guidelines you have that 0.5 from all uh, if you want no bleed if it's no bleed Okay, and what we're gonna do now is to uh, make our first page and the first page is very important because uh, you can show it on Amazon KDB and you can show the people that you have a very good uh, interior inside. So maybe you can show them an egg or also show them the first page, which is very, very important. And it's as much as important as a cover and regard for the cover. I will make another video how to design the cover. But here I want to show you how to design the first page of the interior. So first of all, I will go to insert and maybe we can go for add a word art and press A. And we can write this book belongs 
2. Or maybe this coloring book is better. This coloring book belongs to. Okay, and then we can go like this. It's much more better. And then we can highlight all them together and change the font. We want the font like a good font, not very sharp, smooth, and nice for Easter. So maybe something like that. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good font. Okay, and if we want, we can also highlight it and make it a little bit bigger. 66 is perfect. And we want, what we want to do there now that uh, we want to add a curvy rectangle down here. So we can, someone can write who it belongs to. So we can go for insert and shapes. And we can go for this shape, it looks like a round rectangle. Cool. And then you can make convert it to black first. Or, or we, we want to convert it to shape to fill to white directly, but I want the interior as out the, the outline also to be black. Okay, so I, I convert it here to white, as you can see, and then we can shape the outline. And go for weight if you want a little bit thicker for the outline as you can see it's so thick so you, yeah four four point five point is okay and we can expand this a little bit and here too and here so someone can write the current movie is belongs to whom that's cool uh, it's not that enough I want something more so I want to show you another trick uh, maybe you can go for uh, like I went to Bixby and I wrote Happy Easter and then I found this great and beautiful Happy Easter design and then I opened it on Bixby and I found it's free for commercial use and no attribution required. So I just used it. So I go to, I download it and then I will use it in my PowerPoint right now. So what we're going to do is to insert and this time we will insert a picture. Great. And yeah, this picture I already put it here. So we can just put it here. Looks cool, looks amazing. We can make it a little bit bigger in between the guidelines. And that's pretty good. There we go. As you can see. Uh, I think it's it needs much more, a little bit more uh, modification to make the interior much more better. Maybe we can make a border like here on the on the guidelines so what we're gonna do is to make a bold black rectangle so we go for insert and then shape and then a rectangle and then we can just put a rectangle somewhere doesn't matter and we make it black and shape fill and make no fill so only and we can also adjust as you can see the weight but i think it's okay one or 1.5 Okay, maybe we can make it a little bit more like three or something. Yeah, that's a little bit good. And when we're gonna adjust it on the corners of the guidelines, it's gonna be adjusted automatically as you can see. And here also, and here is the guidelines. And here we go. This looks much more better. So I think there is one more thing that I want to show you that you can also uh, like transfer a vector to a powerpoint and you can change the color of the vector because of course the interior should be black and white so wherever you find a vector with a very good image or a very good graphics on uh, creative fabrica like for example if you go to creative fabrica and i found something like that if you want to use that you can use it in the powerpoint and change the color because it's vector okay but you have to be sure that this vector is okay for uh, print on demand or pod uh, commercial use and also for kdb so what I'm going to do here is it, uh, I took something like that as a vector and I will show you that it's a vector so I will insert it, insert picture and here we go it's EBS it's not a uh, JPEG or PNG it's EBS which is vector form and I can just open it and as you can see here it's really cool and really nice I will insert it and I will minimize a little bit and put it here okay to give it to give this interior a little bit more 
which is design and also uh, like to show the the rulers yeah because sometimes i like to put it you know if you show the rulers you can adjust in the middle if you can see here if you see on the zero section you will see a slider a small slider you can see this it's sliding with me on the ruler look at the ruler yes so i can adjust it on zero exactly so i know it's in the middle and also here the same everything in the middle so i know that everything is good okay so here we go i want to convert this to black and white because the interior should be black and white only so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna press here twice and then go to on color this one on the left section and just i can choose black and here we go that's really cool really beautiful and this is the interior page and it looks very cool very awesome and now i am not like all the people who took the interiors from creative fabrica and just put it like that you have to be more creative to be a little bit unique and yeah to go apart from the competition and to make something unique for yourself and it's very easy it didn't take so much time next video i will show you how to design uh the easter cover book on canva maybe i will use canva so make it easy for you so you can make this page in less than maybe 20 minutes all of this book with the interior with the first page with all of that and what you're gonna do you're gonna you will go for file and then you will go to export as pdf and that's it it's very easy so you will press file and then you will go and export and yeah you can create a pdf here and that's it it's very easy you will use a present you, you will uh, write whatever you want pdf open after publish and then publish and then it's gonna be published as a pdf and that's it you can put on amazon kdb Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you will make me happy for and give me a subscribe and also uh, hit the like button and don't forget to comment on the description if you want anything, if you want anything to improve, if you have any question on KDB, just leave me a comment. I will leave uh, all, everything in the description, uh, all the the so links are everything you need everything you need to have a good design and all the tools that i use in the description section i hope you enjoyed the video and see you in the next video uh, have a nice day bye bye